<laughs> so I'm Kathy with WRLs Out and About, and I came out to Bowie Bowl today to do a story, um, and I really had to try one. Look at this. It's amazing. My first Asa Bowl. Mm. Really good. I feel so healthy now. Isn't that amazing? I can't believe it. And now I'm healthier. All in just like one, one morning. <laughs> so I came out here to do a story. I wanted to do something because Bowie Bowls um, actually won our 2017 Voters' Choice Awards. Um, and I really wanted to highlight them because, I mean, it's amazing. Uh, it's only been around like, what, a year or two? And people love it. The lines are crazy. Crazy. Um, so I wanted to do a little segment that's going to appear on WRL.com and people excited for the Voters' Choice Awards, which are coming up again this year. You can vote and they hopefully, maybe they can win the title again. They can defend the title again. <laughs> we'll see. busy shift started slow um, but I think it's because we were 10 to 1 not 11 to 2 and we've been 11 to 2 for quite a while and um, it's easier to do 10 to 1 when you've got the second shift so that's why we did it and because we we're in Raleigh and wanted to have time to prep um, for the second shift and we um, had WRAL out and about come by and interview us while we were doing the shift. So they're going to do a little write up on us and post it to Instagram. And I think there's, I think all social media platforms, um, she had never had an acai bowl. And so we gave her a surf up and a haoli. And she later posted that um, she stopped by and sees why we won Best Food Truck in the Triangle. 
last year. Uh, we, we got three more water filters uh, dropped off from another customer. That was awesome. Um, huge shout out to um, Living Well Balance for having us out. I know that was a successful event. Um, they also had their tent set up and they were able to sell some of their packages so that was good for them. And then um, we came back and now we're, we're, we're done for getting ready. We've got like an hour and a half, less than an hour and a half we opened the second shift. Um, but I am soaking wet and from sweating so I'm going to go change shirts and get some change and then we'll be back here in like 45 minutes to head to Holly Springs for shift number two. And it's the last Thursday shift for like two weeks because this time next week we'll be in Razzle. Um, that's Brazil, in case you didn't know. Uh, so, yeah man, looking forward to that trip and we're closed this weekend too, so expecting tonight to be a banger. days are um, but you know it's my favorite day it's a, it's a serious day of putting that axe to the tree and whatever we got there and started off kind of slow and I think that was because we were there at 10 instead of 11 last time we were there 11 to 2 and we've been consistent consistently 11 to 2 uh, you know but all, it, all of a sudden it picked up and uh, it was, a, it was a busy, wide open ship. Had WRAL out and about come by, interview us, as I said earlier. That was um, that was pretty cool, kind of telling the story. And she got her first acai bowls and had another customer drop off um, three water filters, which is very awesome. So we're over our 20 water filter goal for the trip to Brazil. So that's pretty awesome. And then banger ship came back. Um, Got the truck ready for the second shift, headed to Holly Springs, and you know we're closed um, all weekend because it's my son's birthday. We've got the surf contest we're going to, and then we're open Monday of next week, and then we're closed until next Wednesday, the following Wednesday, because we're in Brazil. And so, um, you know, it was a busy shift in Holly Springs. Holly Springs has become a consistent, um, busy location, and tonight was was wide open but also on the first shift Katie handled toppings by herself for the first time and she crushed it um, you know her and Alyssa have been um, partnering up Alyssa has been training her and today we let her go by herself and there was no issues that's awesome you know she she's picked it up so quick so that's that's very cool to see um, that she's comfortable doing that so um, it's it's just another day getting after it um, and not a lot a lot of footage because I was so yeah, busy tonight there wasn't a lot of footage because we only had me um, me Alyssa and Anna and Josh and so Josh got a little bit of footage um, I don't know there should if there was you'll see the line yeah 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 so um, there's not gonna be a lot of footage from the second shift but it was wide ass open and I know we got pictures for stories, but just another day of getting after it. Um, tomorrow, Friday, 
it's going to be lifetime in apex which is my assumption is it's going to be wide ass open because we're closed all weekend and then we're open one day and then that's it for like a week so i could be wrong but i think right tomorrow friday is going to be crazy so anywho um I think that's it you know, me and josh grabbed the dinner afterwards but whatever that is that so thank you so much for your attention thank you so much for your continued support we're continuously having customers purchase merchandise louis bowl shirts hats and that it means the world to me so thank you so much for y'all's continued support we will if you don't follow us on youtube please do so if you don't follow us on facebook please do give us a follow and we will see you guys tomorrow at lifetime fitness and apex